Elsewhere, renowned TV journalist Rita Tinina has been laid to rest at her home in Narok County. In an emotional ceremony attended by family, friends, as well as political leaders, Rita's legacy in the media shone through the outpouring tributes from mourners who celebrated T9's impact, as she was fondly called. Rita leaves behind her eight-year-old daughter, Mia Malaika, and partner, Robert Nagila. Ruth Samwe tells us more. In the days where all tears her final journey began at the Omash funeral home in Nakuru, in a Range Rover house, a vehicle chosen because she had planned to take a trip in a Range Rover this April with her friends to celebrate her birthday. The more than 90-kilometer journey saw Rita's motorcade escorted by colleagues to her home in Nosupeni village in Olokirikirai. Her family is still coming to terms with her sudden departure. Akawa mtu mzima na akawa mtu wa kutumkia watu na Mungu amefanya mambo makuu ambaye Mungu pia atamlipa. The queen of storytelling, a trailblazer, an icon are just but few phrases that fellow journalist used to describe Rita. Atujawai kuona Rita amekosana na mtu Rita kuwa kwamba alikuwa na tajiriba kubwa. Rita hakuwa na majivuno. Rita was remembered for her selflessness and stellar performance in her new species. Alikuwa mtu mnyenyekevu. Unajua mara nyingi watu wakifanikiwa maishani, wakipata umaarufu wa aina fulani, watu wanaanza kuwa na kiburi, lakini Rita hakuwa na haya. She worked in folders. Hata asira na fikiri ilikuwa na folder yake ambayo inawekwa kando inaonyesha tu kwa wakati wake na kwa wachache sana kama also present were political leaders including senators Ledama Olekina, Eno Kwambua and Edwin Sifuna among others. President William Ruto's eulogy was read by State House Press Secretary Emmanuel Talam. Rita died in her sleep on the 17th of March this year due to severe pneumonia. Ruth Sarmoy and TV. Everybody.